Hey guys, uh, Don here. I want to talk today a little bit about doing, doing packages uh, for things that we offer in the office. And really, it's something that I, I don't feel all that comfortable with. Uh, currently, I have a, a coach who's a, a podiatrist. He's actually in, a, in another country, and he's kind of helping with, with some tips. And one thing that they do there quite frequently, but it's still not common amongst the podiatrists, is doing packages. And so I just kind of want, want to walk you through this because it's something that I'd like to know your your thoughts. You could certainly uh, re- reply to this, this um, podcast. Uh, you can hit reply and it'll come to me or my email will be around there. But how many of you offer packages? And, and basically what I'm thinking about is and it's based on an experience that I had recently. Recently, I was talking to someone that's a coach, and I was saying, "Well, I want to be maybe coached." And before I before I they started with this this thing called a clarity call, and they said, "You know, what I'm hoping to go over is kind of what I do, how I do it, and kind of what what the cost is going to be for everything." And and they said, "Is that okay? That that's what we're going to plan?" And I said, "Yeah, that's fine." And so I was expecting at the end for them to go over the price. And they did that. They went over, this is the price and this is kind of their process and everything else like that. And it, what I find is we kind of skirt that question. We, we don't, uh, as podiatrists, like to talk about money. It, I'm not comfortable with it. I don't think you're comfortable with it. But it's something that we have to talk about or we can let our staff talk about. I, I know I interviewed Chris Titko, and that'll be coming up. And she has an office manager that has all of those uncomfortable conversations and basically a really good person that's able to um, answer the questions and help the patient to make the decision so the doctor doesn't ever talk about money. And I think that would be ideal, but I don't think that's the case for a lot of us. And what she does is she, let's say someone comes in with metatarsalgia and they need a uh, shockwave or like an amnio injection. Basically, they'll introduce the topic and then they'll have the, the, the office manager kind of go through all the documentation, explaining what it is, explaining the pricing and everything like that. So they can totally stay out of the money aspect. I'd like to know what, what you guys do if you if you do that or if you talk about it. Because I know what I do is uncomfortably uh, sometimes I have to say, you know, our amnio is $1,500 or our orthotics are $550 or the shockwave, we have radial and focal. So we're doing it $200 per session and you'll need between three and four up to six sessions of that. And those are kind of uncomfortable conversations. So what I'm trying to do now is to talk about packages and I introduce it in the beginning. And what that kind of looks like is when I when I see a patient, let's say we're going to talk about plantar fasciitis, I'll say, you know, Mrs. Jones, um, today I'm going to go over what you have, kind of w- what's causing it. And what are the what's the costs involved in terms of the treatment options and how much time it's going to take you to get better? And that's the approach I'm starting at the beginning now. And I'm just working on this. I'd like to know if, if you guys have any better ways of doing this. Uh, and basically, so what I do is I, I see them for the plantar fasciitis. I'll go through my presentations that I've talked to you guys about before. Basically, it's a presentation, talks about, shows a picture of uh, the diagnosis, kind of the different causes with the tightness and things like that. And then it has basically a... a um, a picture of a checklist of all the different types of treatments. Now, when they see that, they get really kind of overwhelmed with all the different treatments because there's hundreds of types of treatments. And then I try to kind of simplify it as well. How how long have you had it? And if it's been over three months, I say, well, it'll probably take about three months to get rid of it. If it's less than three months, it'll probably take less uh, to get rid of it than three months. And and then I'll go over and usually then that's where I have to pick this amount. So if if you add things up, right? And if you think about it in the long term, we have a couple of patients that will do a cortisone, but they'll they'll get right better. But the majority of them aren't like that. The majority of them take between three and six months to get better. And so what I'm telling my patients, and this is kind of what I'm working on right now is, you know, it's going to take you about three months to get better. Okay. It's going to take you three months. And usually it costs about $1,200. And where did I get that $1,200? Well, in my practice, most people are getting the shockwave. So they're getting three sessions of shockwave. And it used to be six when I only had the the radial, but now I have the focused. And so let's say that's $600. And then you have, uh, if, the, if they need it, they'll do like an orthotic. They might do a foam roller. They might do um, other types of things. And those are just the, the $1,200 are just the things that the insurance doesn't cover. Like they don't cover an ultrasound. So I just pick a number and I bring it out right in the beginning for them so that anything else that I talk about is kind of going to be 
within that realm. And that's kind of the, the, the new thing that I'm, I'm trying to do. And I've had this conversation with a couple of patients. And when we bring it out and we talk about the, the white elephant in the room, it, it's a lot easier for patients because some, they're like, there's no way I can do that. Others are going to want to, well, how can I afford it? We talk about care credit and other things like that. And so I'd like to know your, your opinion, what you, what you think, if you guys package anything, how that's going for you. Um, also, I'd like to invite some of you guys. I'm, I'm kind of happy um, in our website, Podiatry Practice Mastery. We've now got up to 100 people that are interested in the group sessions. So we, we only have 100 um, uh, places at each of these group sessions. And uh, I'd like you to uh, be present there. So I'd, I'd go there and I'd put your, your name and email and we'll send you the information if you wanted to be part or get the recording afterwards of that group session. Okay. Have a great day.